Hey guys, welcome back to another Animal Crossing New Horizons video. I'm getting straight into this. I am not going to decorate the flower shop yet because I forgot to pay for it last night to make it bigger. So instead, I'm going to get into the bigger things, which is decorating my house because I haven't done that in years. So we'll get into that right after this. Uh, right now on Terra, it's 2.40 on Saturday. No big announcements today. Instead, allow me to wish you a fun Terra weekend. I kind of wish it was a 4th of July um, celebration thing. So far, it doesn't seem like it, but someday I feel like they will add it. But, you know, call it America Day or something. I don't know. Something cool like that. Anyway, we got some stuff in the mail. I think it's just my wetsuit. Um, yes, Nook Mileage Program. There we go. Climbed via the Nook... Alright, yeah, so this is all just regular stuff that I collected a while ago, so not too much of an issue there. So, now that we got that, we could head off to Nook's Cranny, which I need to go to anyway and check out what furniture they have, just in case. Hey, Diana. Um, well, hello there, dog. I want to chat. Uh, it's yet another splendid day on Terra. Oh, I know I sound unusually chipper, but who to blame me, dog? Okay, so when I got Diana, right... I didn't want her at first. I just, I was like, whatever, she makes some good money. But I, you guys were right. Like, there was a comment a while ago. I think it was you, Brenda, but you told me that I would enjoy Diana. And so far, she has been the best, like, that I've had. She kind of reminds me of Savannah. And, like, it works very well. So I think I'm going to end up keeping her. Like, I think this is the animal that I want. So expect her to be uh, staying at my uh, island now. <laughs> It's actually pretty cool, not gonna lie, so... Alright. Alright, let's see. We got a couch right here. I think I already got the yellow couch. Um, but we're gonna grab it again just in case. I'm gonna check the turnip prices too, just in case I need to invite some people to come over. Uh, other than that, though, I'm gonna get straight onto the house. Current price is 53 bucks. That is crap, man. I don't even know how that gets so bad. What is on that side, actually? Oh, it's just a vanity. Okay. Oh, actually... There's a washer right here. Seems like you're interested in a deluxe washer. So right now I have a deluxe... Mm. Mm. I have to have bugs in my inventory though, right? I don't know. Dang it. Okay. I'm going to have to go get some money real quick. I need that deluxe washer. I, I don't I don't know what I want it for, but I got two wetsuits now. Look at that. Bam. What is this hat? It's a rain hat. Let's wear that. Bam. It's pink. It doesn't really match the style we're going for, but we're going to wear it anyway. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna design my room as, my other room, but I kind of put something in there, you know? It's, uh, kind of being empty the whole time. So I decided, why would I just leave it like that for the rest of my life? Why wouldn't I just decorate it? And so, now I'm gonna decorate it, and it's gonna be something. I think it, I wanted to decorate two of them. I might just decorate one for now, but in the meantime, I will also pay off that house so I could actually finish off... The, uh, the flower shop area, which, as you can see, here's the ladybug and rose thing, which I was going to take and decorate the other place with. I think the back one is not decorated yet, so we'll get to that one real quick. Um, Alright, so in here, I'm going to have to put some stuff in here, and I'm going to pull out a bunch of stuff that I don't want, so that I don't want to keep holding on to, should I say. Alright, so, we got... We got a lot of Imperial stuff, so maybe we'll pull out the Imperial stuff. Let's see, Imperial, Imperial Dining Table. Let's see, there's got to be more Imperial stuff. I know that for sure. I have a lot of Imperial stuff, so maybe we'll stick with the Imperial design so far, and then we'll move on from there. But I do need this Imperial stuff out because I have a lot of it. Um, I'm just going to keep... Oh, these are all moving to my pockets. So I'm going to have to place these down soon. So we're just going to keep going and grabbing stuff, though. I have a lot of Imperial stuff that I need to get rid of because I've been holding on to them for a long time. All right. Here's what's going to happen. We're going to open the decoration mode, right? We're going to open the pockets and we're going to, like, actually place them oops, gonna place them down. Everything that I have Imperial-wise, I'm going to have down. Um, I don't have any Imperial chairs, which I'm kind of sad about. I have one. I have one Imperial chair, but... As long as I have one, I should be okay in that regard. I have... Uh, I don't think I have any more Imperial stuff. We could put a uh, high-end stereo system. Let's see if we could uh, kind of turn it a little bit like that and put it on our Imperial. We can't. Dang it. Okay, that's more of a ground thing. But 
we will keep it just in case. Um, let's see. We got a simple panel. I don't need that. I think a paper lantern would be pretty cool, but I only have one of those. So we're going to stick with the uh, pink lantern right now, just so it goes with the kind of look that we're going for. We can even do street organ, which would be pretty awesome. Um, let's see. I want to go for more of that imperialistic look, so I don't want to grab stuff that won't look good in this room, but... Let's see, um, a microwave, that'd be perfect. I got lamps, but I don't want to do lamps, that's lame. Who wants to do lamps? A wooden fish, possibly. Hmm. Well. Alright. We got a lot of imperial wall hangings. That I do, n I think I hung around the whole house already. Dang it, we'll put a breaker down, though. And we'll also put down a clock, which we're going to have to decorate the walls anyway with some kind of different wallpaper. So I'm not too concerned about getting that done right away, but eventually I'll get to it. So, okay. Now for the wallpapers. Okay. I want the walls to kind of look something like, mm, like a reddish, but the chocolate brown doesn't really work with it. I want something r like red. We got imperial walls. Yes. Perfect. But do we have black flooring? That's what I'm looking for mostly. We have dirt flooring. Although that's not going to go well with the flooring. So we'll go dark wood pipe flooring. Bam. And then we'll go back up here. And then we'll start decorating. So we'll put the kimono to the side. The, let's see. The bamboo grass up to the front. We'll put the champion's pennant on the little count. Can I not put anything up there? That's kind of lame. But we'll put that in the corner there. Um, the clock. <laughs> We're going to have to put that clock up there. Let's see. We'll put it... Well, let's see if we can put it in the middle here. Oh, man. You can't put that perfectly in the middle. But, you know, we have we have that there so far. So, we'll worry about that later. But, back to floor. And then, we have the street organ, which doesn't match. So we're going to change... Oh, did not mean to do that. Let's go back here. And then, we got this uh, street... This thing right here, that kind of matches the room, so we're going to keep it. We're going to bring this bad boy straight to the middle. And we're going to twist this around kind of to the front here. So let's push this up a little bit. Put it up here. We'll put the chair right here, actually. Just to give it that look right there. Put you there. And we got to play some music, clearly. Um, also, I better make move that breaker, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. I want the breaker to be more off on the side, so... Let's put that right in the front. And then, let's see. It's got to be something else I'd want, right? Um, I got a lot of scallops. Holy crap. I, two flowers, maybe. You know? You got black lilies. Could you put it on here? Yes! Something. At, at some point, I'd wanted something up there. Let's see. Do I have anything else that I could put up there? Ooh, the pearl, actually. That was one thing I wanted to see if I could decorate with. But where is the pearl? It should be in this menu as far as I'm concerned. There it is. Yes, pearl. Where'd it go? Okay. I got one single pearl, and I'll put that right there. That way it kind of looks decorated. The kimono looks fine right there. It just doesn't really match. Um, we'll go back down real quick. We want a carpet. We want it to match the room a little bit, so let's see. Can we do that? That looks fine. That's a cool carpet. At least they think it looks fine. Maybe we'll do a velvet stool. Kind of like in the front of the area. Kind of show off that there's another, like, kind of chair. But I just want something, you know? Let's see. Um, I don't want this to be the only stuff that's in here. So I'm going to have to find something else that kind of goes with the room. I need to buy more Imperial stuff. But that is for a later future date. Because clearly I don't have enough Imperial stuff to kind of decorate around. Uh, the wallpapers would be nice and stuff like that. But I'll have to get to that eventually. Let's see. We got a South Pole. That would be cool at like a barber shop. But not in here. It wouldn't match too much in here. Um, we got a vanity which might look good somewhere. But so far I don't have any room for that. We want mostly wall stuff. If I can get some nice wall stuff it would be nice. Ooh. Maybe I would want to go with a trophy more. Mm, I don't know. It's a hard decision. The rover's briefcase, too. 
I don't know. Would this a wall-mounted TV go in this? Probably not. Um, we could throw in some designs on the wall, though. Like, I don't want to do that one. I want to do more of a like a flower wraith. You know what? We're gonna make a flower wraith. And we're going to see what we need first, and we're going to make a wraith that's made out of flowers. Because I do not want to use just regular bunny day wraiths again. I want something that I that I can actually make and decorate it with. Because I'm sick of using the same thing. So we got white, yellow, and red mums. And I think mm, pink, purple, and red. Oh, nope. Which one's better, this one or this one? I like this one because it has darker colors. And I think that's mostly what we're looking for. But... Honestly, if we're going with anything, that Hyacinth thing is way better. But that's also really cool. But I just don't have the Cosmos for it. That's also a thing that I've been making sure. So, let me see. You know what? We're going to go... I want to do the flower stand, too. But I don't have orange flowers. I mean, I might. I should probably go check. But I don't think so. Um, I'm going to go with this one. The pink, purple, and red mums. So, all we have to do is go collect some of those. I think two of each... I didn't really read, but I'm going to assume two of each. If not, I can make extra for the flower shop when it gets here. But I want to decorate it a little bit nicer to get that kind of like feeling in it. And I'll be able to play music so it isn't so quiet in there as well. Oh, I still have mail. I didn't check everything. Leaf printed wetsuit and KK Stroll. You know, maybe we'll see if KK Stroll looks good. Okay, so we need red, which two red right here, uh, two purple. Let's grab some here. And was it yellow or was it red, purple, and pink? Okay. I'm pretty sure that I have pink somewhere. There's one pink. And two pink. Oh, I didn't even grab the pink. Oops. Oh, look at those purple back there. They're growing pretty well. Let me check on the orange ones, see if how well they're growing. I don't think they've been... Oh, yeah. We got our orange one, boys. This is it. This is the moment we've been waiting for. Okay, we're going to move it off the thing here, and we're going to put it up here. So, that's a yellow. Dang it. I thought it was... Ugh. Okay, we're we're going to take it and plant it right here. Um, I wanted orange, but, you know, we you can only do so good at some points in time. Um, eventually, we'll get an orange one, and we'll keep checking on that. There's no flowers down here. I don't know why I checked down here. Um, up here... We should have a money tree and also some different colors. Okay, we have three gold so far, so I'm going to have to do more stuff with that. Um, I'm going for the gold there, but we're trying to make more off of that. So let's see. I think I got a yellow on accident. KK Stroll and Leaf Print Wetsuit. I also want to show off these new wetsuits. So I'll show you guys different ways you can get the wetsuits. And um, exactly, there's no difference between them, but... They're just fun to kind of like have to like kind of decorate your kind of swimming habits and stuff. Let's go downstairs so we can make this real quick. But yeah, that's just, it makes it fun, you know? You have all this new stuff and everything. It's just easier to decorate. So, let's craft this bad boy. We got fancy mummery. Ah, oh, I need three. All right. Heading back outside to collect more. <laughs> I thought it was two, but apparently it's three. Either way, though, we're still going to be able to collect it and be able to decorate this. And it's going to be looking pretty nice, I feel. At least for the meantime, that I feel like it's going to look good. I don't know how long that'll last, but I need more Imperial stuff. So eventually I'll come back and add more Imperial stuff to it. I think I already got three purple. Actually. Nope, that was my third purple. Alright, that's another one. And let's get the last pink, which I'm glad I had exactly three pink flowers kind of lets it all off. I don't need to go and search for more because I have all of them. That's the good part about this because usually I would have an issue. Oh, what is that? Is that a cicada? That is a cicada. Is that a one that I need though? That's the question. Let's go slowly towards this cicada. Oh, he knows I'm here. He knows. Got him. I think it's a giant, but I can't tell. Oh, brown cicada. So I've caught in this one already. Also, I'm getting a lot of Lily of the Valleys. They mostly grow up here. Um, I want to make sure that I'm not missing any Lily of the Valleys because they pop up randomly. They pop up so randomly. I don't. Sometimes I don't even know where they're growing. So there shouldn't be any over there on that direction. But there should be some more popping up here. As far as I know, they grow on the hills. 
and I'm gonna have to figure out what I do with all these flowers as well as well these ones and figure out what I'm gonna decorate over here I want to decorate something but we'll get to that eventually also we'll get to decorating the beach up in the back kind of making it look a little bit nicer than it is I, I have no clue what to do currently but you know we'll get to it eventually so let's go downstairs and figure out what we got down there oh we got to build it first but we'll go downstairs and build this bad boy and make our way back upstairs and kind of decorate it I'm, all, I'm doing this all for just one little mum ray thing so this better be worth it plus it's my first time making a wraith i think i think i made a wraith before actually um i think it was from one of the houses but nonetheless it's my first time making a wraith for me so Let's put this bad boy up there and see where we can put it. I hope it actually looks nice, though. I'm getting a feeling like it's not going to look that nice. And that's going to be sad. <laughs> uh, okay. Wraith. Okay, hold on. Let me go to this menu. And we're going to put this wraith down. Fancy mum wreath. We're going to put this right in the middle. Well, You know what? Let's kind of put it over here. I got an idea, actually. So... We got this fancy mum wraith in here, and we don't have much over there. Let's go back in here, and we're going to take one of the d wall designs in here and put it in the other room, because I feel like it doesn't really match. It does, but it doesn't. The one up there, if you can see it. So, let's get on this wall design. Oh, did not mean to do that. Let's take this, mm, let's take this bad boy, and we're going to put another wall design up there, just because. So, let's see i don't think i have a oh i not mean to do that i don't think i have a tv anywhere in this room i don't want to put a tv though oh man let's see we got cuckoo clock we got towels and we got let's go for more of this i think this would match a little bit better with the kind of look that we're going for in here which it kind of does. It looks pretty nice. I'm going to go with that one instead, though. Because it's a front room, and it's kind of like a like a grandma house. <laughs> and I don't want to go with like that in here. Because this is kind of like an imperial area. I'm kind of going for that certain look in here. And I don't want to ruin it with just, you know, a wraith right in the middle and nothing else. This way, the imperial design will kind of go together. And the flag kind of ruins it. I think I'm going to get rid of the flag. And I'm going to take, I'm actually going to do more designs. And the way I'm going to do it is I'm going to take out some of these. Let's see. I need, I'm going to take out at least 10 of those and 10 sticks. And I'm going to try to make some stuff out of that. Uh, the bamboo tree. Oh, let's see. It's a leaf printed tense Tenzaku that reads, may the island continue to flourish economically so we're gonna pull this back this way and we're gonna turn it like this i don't know if that looks nice it should be fine um i want to get a pink tree in here and not just any pink tree i want i don't know what it's called uh pink petal what is it called let me see uh cherry blossom cherry blossom tree that way it kind of like you know shows the imperial design in here I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to say this or explain it in any way, but th that's kind of what I'm getting an idea of. So let me show you the pink uh, cherry blossom idea that I had. I think I probably passed it, but we're going to keep going up and see if we could find it just in case I didn't pass it. And I think I did. Okay. We're going to go all the way to the bottom. Let's do this. And I think it was kind of in this area. Yeah. We got the cherry blossom bonsai. And we got the cherry blossom bandages. I think what I'm going to go for is I'm going to go for more of the bonsai. So let me grab some clay for my inventory. Um, this way I can get the bonsai kind of look to it instead. It's like a tree, a small tree. And I'd rather have the tree than anything. Oh, let's go back here. Bam. This way I'm kind of like getting a little bit of... I don't know. I feel like Imperial Design kind of mixes with that cherry blossom look. But I'm just going thinking out of the box. Let's let's see how it actually looks, and then and then we'll judge it. We'll we'll, we'll heavily judge it. Possibly good, possibly bad. You never know. 
<laughs> you never know what it's going to look like. Especially when I'm designing things. Because I do not know how to design stuff. Alright. So we'll put that up. And we need to go to the very top. Because I just put it in here. Um, let's go to new. And I accidentally went all the way to the bottom. It should be there though. What? What? Okay. Time. Type. Oh, maybe it's in my inventory. Let's see. Cherry Blossom Bonsai. Okay. Oh, that's tiny. Oh, that's really tiny. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to get a table for that. Um, I think I have a sing... Oh, it's, it's green, though. I don't know if I want a green one there. Oof. Um... You know what we're going to do? We're going to take this green table and we're going to try to design it. Maybe to black or red. Let's see if we have some stuff in here that we could actually design it with. But there we go. I do not want to put it in here looking green because it just doesn't match. Um, I was thinking the same about that little uh, bamboo thing that I put down. That doesn't match at all. It, does, it just doesn't look good. So I'm probably going to get rid of that and hope for the best. In that regard, at least. So, let's get down here and let's make me a nicer table that I got. So, we got the iron garden table and we have brown, black, and white. We're gonna go with the black, of course, because I mean, we're putting the pink thing on top of it, so I suppose this is gonna look a lot better. Actually, I thought I saw that you could customize your shovel. Now, if I'm wrong, it's only the handle. Yeah, it's only the handle. Who would want to customize your shovel if it's only the handle? It's going to break anyway. You'd have to customize it every single time if you wanted to customize it. I wish they would just let you automatically do it that color. I mean, like you're making out it out of like raw materials, and those colors are always going to be the same. So, I don't know. It's a confusing time in, in, in the, the Animal Kingdom, okay? So, let's put this bad boy up. What else do I got in here? What is this stuff? A champion's pennant. I didn't want that. And the double sofa. Okay, so we'll put this bad boy. Nope, not the double sofa. The cherry blossom bonsai up there. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. We'll take you out. And let's move you over to the corner over here. Since it looks kind of empty. Bam. And let's turn you on. We're going to register the song real quick just to get it in. And then we're going to listen to it. I don't think it fits there. I think I have an Imperial song, if I'm not wrong. Spring Blossoms. That also could work. But I, th I think there was a song called Imperial, if I'm not mistaken. But it might not be. Um, let me see. Blue Ballad, KK Rider, KK Comrade, Forest Life. Alright, we're either going to go with that one or this one. I think this one works better. But this is a little nice room. Cute little nice room. So, when you go straight into this, you're like, oh, cool. There's a little table up here. So, you got some food, you know? You got some food right in the middle. You could spin it, you know, get whatever you want. That's actually a really cool table, how it spins like that. You know, you want to collect some stuff from this side of the table, but you don't want to reach all the way across. You can just turn it around like that. But you got two types of chairs, just in case I'm the type of person. Also, that I didn't have a lot of uh, Imperial chairs. Um, we have a little desk lamp here, or a lava lamp here that's colored pink. Uh, right adjacent to that, there's a pink bonsai tree right across. Kind of matches the whole room, you know? You got a black table underneath it with your Imperial debt, like dresser and chester should i say you can get changed out of it or whatever you want you got the pearl showing and the imperial thing at the top we got our you know i forgot what that's called let's see what it's called real quick um kimono stand which you could uh put on a kimono real quick or not you got your uh, speaker system out here so you can listen to music with your friends and that will be my imperial room for now now let's see if there's anything that i could order that's kind of imperial so we're gonna just look up imp so we can kind of get an idea of what Imperial stuff we actually own. Um, input, we've got an Imperial chest, Imperial decorative wall shelf, Imperial dining chair, dining table, Imperial partition, which we can order for the next time. Uh, we got an Imperial wall, and that is it for the Imperial area. Uh, we got some kimonos and stuff, but we could do really good with that kimono partition because we can put it in this corner right here. Or we could even put it... 
I don't know where else we put it. Maybe we'll get rid of this and put the, it right here. But that is the kimono. So now we're going to leave this house and I'm going to kind of show off the wetsuits that I got. Uh, I think it was yesterday. The wetsuits are going to kind of be like really cool things that I've gotten. And I think they're awesome, honestly. If I'm going to be completely honest with you. They're really cool wetsuits that you could like. Let me see. Let me put a lot of the sticks away. I grabbed too much sticks. And there's some glasses here that I don't recognize. Nook Ink Snorkel. Let's wear that real quick. And I like that better already. Okay. So, that was obviously a different snorkel. Okay. I had a green one on, and now I have the Nook Ink one, which kind of has that blue design that the Nook Ink takes on. At least in my island. I don't know if it's the same for every island, but for my island, it's blue. Now, let's go to the edge where the water is, and I'll kind of show off all of the stuff. Um, for the last few days, like three days already, it's, it was raining non-stop. So my flowers have been growing like crazy because of it. Um, ooh, found that right away. Let's read that real quick. I found this DIY recipe written in my dream journal this morning. I don't remember writing it down. This seemed like a good way of passing along my recipe idea. It's simple if you have the parts. All right. Wooden block chest. I think I already have... Oh, I don't have it. Nice. I'm not I have not gotten a DIY in a while that I have not had. Well, I've gotten some. I can't say that. Like, let me show you a couple of the things that I have gotten. That's cool. Um, let's do this. Alphabetical order obtained. So, we got a mer mermaid shelf, which is pretty cool. Uh, we got a bamboo stool. Uh, also pretty cool. Uh, ironwood DIY workbench, which is one of the ones that I wanted anyway. We got an angled signpost, which I said on video was pretty awesome. Sci-fi wall. We got a uh, chocolate herring herringbone wall. Pretty cool. A bamboo basket. Interesting stuff. Not going to lie. I might put it in my Zen forest when I get a chance. A kettle bathtub. I have ideas for that as well. The pansy table for the flower shop. Um, we got underwater flooring. You know, stuff like that. We even got this palm tree that I wanted to put on the beach, but I, I, haven't, got, I haven't gotten to it. So we'll get there. Um, but anyway, let's get to the, the, the little wetsuits that we got. So, we got, first of all, the Nook Ink wetsuit, which, you know, that colorful blue, and it matches with this mask. I think I'm going to go with the Nook Ink suit, because it has the leaf on it, and also, it's blue, and it matches the mask. So, let's go on to the next one real quick. We got the horizontal white wetsuit, which is the one that I had previously. I do not like it that much. It's kind of bright, too bright. And then we got this wetsuit, which is a leaf wetsuit. It's honestly pretty cool. Uh, it, it's perfect color. Pink and purple is a really good color for this. But also it's shorts and stuff, so I think it's more aimed towards females. But you can still swim in it, which I thought was pretty cool. So, but for now, I oh, there's bubbles. I got to go for that real quick. I can't pass that down, you know. There we go. Let's see what we got. We got barnacles, just normal acorn barnacles. Okay. And I'm going to show off all the underwater uh, stuff that i gotten so far. I don't know if you guys can catch this stuff yet or if it's only for the northern hemisphere or what the whole plan is for this anyway. Um, I'm going to put my Nook Ink wet suit back on. But yeah, that's where I'm going to go for most of the time. Uh, let's see. In my Critopedia, I've gotten a few fish or sea creatures, which is seaweed, sea urchin, pearl oyster, mussel, slate pencil urchin which i thought was interesting sea grapes uh sea anemone moon jellyfish scallop whelk sea slug sea star octopus gazami crab is there one that i didn't donate no i, I donated them all um acorn barnacle spotted garden eel and sea pineapple all those things uh most of them come during the day or any time of the day but some of them also don't so Anyway, I think that's where we're going to end off the video because I've showed everything that I needed to show today. Um, look at this. You could grow this on regular sand that you grow in the middle of your island, which I thought was pretty cool. But at this point, I'm going to end off the video. So thank you guys very much for watching. Have a really good night. Do not let the bed bugs bite. And have a great morning if it's morning. Peace.